Will you please stand for a moment of silent meditation and remain standing as we honor our nation in reciting the Pledge of Allegiance. And now, join me for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for the Foley High School alma mater. Foley schools are alma mater to thy praise will sing for ideal so lofty o'er us to Good morning, Foley High School. My name is Jordan Drake. Today is September 3rd, and it's a gold day. We've got some notes for you today, so stay tuned, because you're watching the Lion Pride News. Good morning, Foley High School. My name is George Austin. Here are today's birthdays. Happy birthday to Genesis Rivera, Tara Inslee, Andy Quaid, and Kirsten Walters. Have a great day and a happy birthday. Today's thought of the day is... The first step to being respected is to look respectable. Hey, I'm James Akins, the assistant principal of ninth grade. Also, I'm in charge of buses. There's a few things in the video, obviously, that concern me and the administration here at Foley High. Just want you to know that uh, we're definitely concerned about student safety. So two things, don't run out in front of buses until you hear the actual brake sounds uh, or you get a signal from the bus driver administration. The second thing, we have a few that are trying to board buses at the last minute. We need you to get to the bus line and also in, and the bus is on first wave uh, immediately so we don't have any kind of accidents. So take care of Foley High. Go Lions. Hey Foley High School, as you know, Officer Williams is here with me. I don't know that all of you know that he is taking a different role with the Foley Police Department um, beginning next week and we're going to miss him. But he was our first school resource officer here and has done a great job for many years. I don't know exactly how long now, LeBron, but almost 10 years. <laughs> wow. But uh, done a wonderful job for us. I know that some of y'all have almost grown up with him, and uh, we really, really appreciate him. The teachers and staff here appreciate him. I know that you students here appreciate him. Um, I'm going to make an announcement before I get out of here. We're talking on Friday. You'll see this on Tuesday. But hopefully some of you get a chance to hug him before he leaves here, and he'll be around town, so it's not like he's going to the other side of the world. Yeah, but we right. want to thank you for all you've done for Foley High School, the I kids and too. everybody here. Mm -hmm. Anything you'd like to say to the kids real quick? Well, I just want to say, guys, I'm really going to miss you guys. You know, I love each and every one of you guys and all. I just love walking the hallways, you know, talking with you, at lunch, sitting down, having fun with you, we meeting you outside of school and everything. It just, it's really going to be different without being around you guys, you know, but it's just the next step in my life, and all. I think it's about that time. But I'm really going to miss you guys. Let's give them one more Go Lions. Go, go Lions! <laughs> the homecoming dance is October 5th. If you or anyone you know is in need of a dress for the dance, Miss Beverly has some donated dresses. You can find them in Miss Beverly room 100. 
There will be a Scholars Bowl meeting tomorrow immediately after school in Ms. Hill's room 408. At the meeting, students will vote on a practice schedule and receive permission slips for the meets. Interclub Council will meet again Thursday after school in room 402. Club and class representatives need to be there. Homecoming dress down days will be chosen at this meeting. If any club or class would like to participate in the homecoming week festivity, like window decorating, a parade float, or door decorating, please see Ms. Kate in room 807 or Ms. Payne in room 402 for a participation form. The National Honor Society will have a mandatory meeting for all juniors and seniors Thursday at 310 in room 911. The 2019-2020 applications for the Key Club are now available. You can pick up yours in Ms. Lovett's room 912 or Ms. Warren's room 913. Applications are due September 6th. If you are an old member, you must reapply. If you have any questions, please contact Ms. Horan or Ms. Lovett, or just pass by their rooms. Any student interested in participating in the Poetry Out Loud competition this year should stop by Ms. Payne's room 402 to pick up information. I'm Michael Bingert, and this is the Locker Room Report. This week in sports, the football game this week will be at home against Theodore Bobcats at 7 o'clock. Don't forget the tailgate before the game at 5. The freshman and varsity volleyball teams will be traveling to Bay Minette this afternoon to take on Baldwin County High School at 4.30 and 5.30. Also this week, the varsity volleyball team will be participating in the Back to School Bash in Fairhope on Friday and Saturday. Make sure to come out and support your Lions. And that's all from the Locker Room Report. Good morning, Foley High School. Today for lunch, we're going to be having chicken wings, mashed potatoes, fruit, baked beans, and biscuits. And for our fast food line, we'll be having a breaded chicken sandwich, stuffed crust pizza, potato wedges, and fruit. Don't forget your grab and go, and have, have a, a great, great day, day Foley High, High School. school. Alright, well that's all the announcements we have for you today on our Day Line Pride News. Don't forget today is Golden. Our shout-outs go to Destiny Williams and Timothy Stewart. Have a great day, Foley High School.